I'm going to show you how to get the frozen needle. This is an ice rapier, a thrusting sword with impaling thrust. And it will do frost buildup on your enemy. So if you want a frost thrusting sword, you can get this over at the King's Realm Ruins by Lake Liurnia. The nearest fast travel is northern Lake Liurnia Lakeshore and is underneath the secret floor. Let me show you how to get it. So I am now at North Liurnia Lakeshore up here on the map. And right here is the map for this exact zone. We're going to head to the northeast to the King's Realm Ruins. And in the back right will be a secret floor that you can attack. So if you go through here, you can go to the back corner and you'll see like a gateway in a busted down area right here. When you see that gateway, you know you're here. You just come back in and right here, you'll hit the ground. Down here is a boss room. Now I'm going to see if I can just one tap this guy using the OP spell, but we're about to find out what happens. All right, so that worked. I one tapped in the Royal Revenant. And he, when he dies, he reveals this door. And behind this door is a chest. And in this chest is the item that we want, the frozen needle. So the frozen needle is a thrusting sword that has impaling thrust and causes frost buildup. So now it's time to try this thing out. And I want to say a few things. You can't put Ashes of War on it. It does frost damage. Let's take a look at it real fast. Uh, e, and, e strength scaling, D deck scaling at level 1. 18 decks to use, 11 strength to use. And it has Impaling Thrust, which is just a normal thrust, okay? But what's really interesting about this rapier is that normal attacks normal. Everything's normal about it. Everything's like a rapier except for one little quirk. If you do a heavy attack, it fires an ice projectile out further than the range of the weapon. So you can actually get an extended... Oh, no, he's going to grab me. You can get an extended reach on the heavy attacks with it. Not a super far reach, though, but enough to catch someone off guard. So very interesting attack uh, that does the same thing as a normal attack. It does its frost buildup. It does similar damage to just hitting them, because you're hitting them does... I think does less damage, actually. Also, uh, the heavy thrust does a lot of damage. And then here's some normal attacks. And that one only lock is a frost buildup. There's heavy attacks that apparently can miss point blank. So that's kind of weird, but okay. Well, there you go. That is the frozen needle. That's everything it does. A really interesting ice thrusting sword in Elden Ring.